terms of what you're going to do, if you find it doesn't want to glide in flexion, you take him into flexion, and then you try to glide him in flexion to try to open the left facet. So it's quite easy in some ways because the position of restriction, you work into that. Okay? If he doesn't want to say extend, then you would then glide him in extension. Okay? Yeah. So you would just glide him in extension from there. And then when you come into neutral and you retest, you think maybe it's feeling a little easier. You can if you want to, rather than push, if it's tender especially, you might say to him, it does not matter, slowly push your head to your right, so he is literally just translating right, 10, 9, 8, 7, relax, and then you can do like a muscle energy technique, there's nothing wrong with pushing to the left, push left, so one is what we call a PIR of MET, one is called an RI of MET, it does not matter if you push to the right or push to the left. One contracts the same muscle, the other contracts the opposite. Okay, so you have an inhibition technique. Relax, but either way, you still have a window of opportunity where the muscle is now relaxed and it allows you as a therapist to slowly articulate the joints. Okay, remember it's about the cervical spine, yeah, not really, but the cervical spine muscles. So we are just trying to articulate. And I do think if you can get the top vertebra move in, it will take pressure off the middle one. This is where the problem is. Or the pain is, I should say. Okay, so from there. And then you can just translate each one. So have a go at translating, left and right, each vertebra, until you feel it doesn't want to go one way. And focus on that movement. It doesn't tell you in neutral, you don't know if it's fixed open or closed. Add in extension. If it doesn't want to extend, it's closed on the same side. As in closed, sorry, it's fixed open, on, but on the same side. And then if you flex, and he doesn't want to glide, you know it's going to be fixed close on the opposite side. So flexion is on the opposite. Extension is on the same side as the side you translate. So you push in right, it's on the right. Okay, if you flex and you go from right to left, as you flex, it's on the opposite side. So flexion opposite, FO, extension, same side. Maitland has a few different ways of, of doing that. Okay, you alright guys? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So I would then side bend movements, I would translate. So I'm just trying to get some motion into each of the facet joints from there. I will show you a minute, minute pleasure because I don't think I'm already ended up doing half of you here. <laughs> so which is not, not a problem. Okay. Okay. But if I like for me, if I just wanted to open this right side, you okay tennis, it's just for me to do something here? <coughs> Let's say I, <coughs> you say to me, I think the right side is, is, is closed, as in like you, you, you're flexing and you're pushing and this side doesn't want to open on his right side. Then for me, C1, 2, I would probably come in side bend, let me just feel. He doesn't feel so bad here. And I'll just do a little T, you know, I can do a slow speed, but slow is still fast. Okay, my slow is still faster than most people's. Um, so I can, I can just tease him and just open it. He's not, he's not so bad in this top left, this is right top right. So I can just come in here and I can just, just tease there. I know. Yeah, so I can just tease it. Okay, and just open it a little bit. Yeah, I mean, it actually wasn't too too bad on that side. So that's opening the right side. If the facets are closed, I'll, I'm going to open it. <coughs> but his left side is the one. So I'm going to... Oh, you're stuck on that side. You're going to make a noise on that left one. Okay. I'm just going to, if I wanted to close from a, my perspective, rather than rotate into open, I might side side bend. So we have to be very careful on the side bend because the fast set is going to close on the other one. So you definitely don't want to be pushing too far because you can obviously impact them. Okay, whereas rotation, you're quite safe, fish. Yeah, whereas if you're trying to side bend, you almost want to close down. So if I do a side bend technique on this left side, I would still side bend and rotate. Completely relaxed. There you go. And I'm going to come in here, and I'm just going to come in, and the thrust is more of a. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. Okay, now it's all okay now. Yeah. <coughs> so he was jammed on that left side. I said he's going to make a noise out of that one. You okay, mate? You can dance. Yeah, you can dance. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I open.